Morning to you. We begin with new developments in breaking news you watched unfold live here on Two Works For You. A man is now in custody after a long standoff with Broken Arrow police. And during that time, you see his house caught fire. Now, officers were originally called out after a 911 hang-up call from a woman who told them she was kidnapped. Two Works For You reporter Micah Hatfield spoke to a witness with a front row seat. There was glass breaking, loud bangs, the SWAT team calling for Joey Brashears to come outside with his hands up and even a fire. But directly next door, Heather DeVoe sat inside her home and watched it all unfold. I'm used to the cops showing up, but I'm not used to that many cops or the SWAT team. The BA special operations team on scene because Brashears' girlfriend told police he kidnapped her. She was able to escape earlier Thursday morning. Today we learned she lived with the suspect. She told investigators that she had tried to leave several times, but each time that she tried to leave, she was held down and beaten by the suspect. The woman has injuries to her face, head, shoulders, back, and legs. DeVoe says for the last six months, she could hear the couple yelling from inside her home while the windows were closed. She tries to keep to herself, though, but DeVoe can't say the same thing for Brashears throws things at my dogs. I was thinking he was taking pot shots at my dog with a BB gun at one point because she kept coming in with bruises. DeVoe stayed in her home the entire standoff. She says the scariest part was when the fire broke out. DeVoe tweeting these pictures to me during the more than six hour ordeal. I, I knew that there was at least one officer in the front that knew that I was home, but I didn't know if anybody in the back did. So I just put one sign up in the front and then one sign up in the back so that they you know, knew <laughs> if there was a problem that they should come check on me. Police still don't know what sparked the fire. After the flames were out, police found Brashears in the garage. When he was taken into custody, officers say he refused to talk. Brashears is being charged with kidnapping, aggravated assault and battery, resisting arrest, and interfering with an emergency call. In Broken Arrow, Micah Hatfield, Two Works For You.